if you want to learn how to make a gift like this, stay tuned. Yeah. Mm. Come on. Yeah. Hello lovelies, this is going to be a really quick video because I don't want to waste too much time. So, I'm going to show you guys how to do what I just showed you. So, first thing you want to do is have your edit open in Photopea. I made this little edit specifically for this tutorial. BNHA. Love it. Okay. So, next thing you need to do is you're going to find yourself a GIF with a black background or a white background, hopefully, or a green one because green screen makes sense. So how I find these sorts of GIFs is I look up Tumblr GIF overlays and then boom, it brings up a bunch of cool stuff. So I've already downloaded this, which is amazing. So now that I've done that, might I remind you that this is all possible using your phone or other handheld device. So next thing you're gonna do is you're gonna go in, I already have it open, but I'm gonna show you guys what I did. I went to file, then I went to open, and then you're going to probably look through your document or browsing section on your device, and then I opened it, and cool, right? I opened it, and then everything was just like, boom, cool. So, after doing that, I'm going to make sure that my GIF is selected, meaning that this entire layer, quote-unquote, is selected and highlighted. So now I'm going to go to layers and I'm going to duplicate into, you're going to choose the destination you're going to duplicate your image into. So I'm going to duplicate it into the edit. So the edit, I hope it's your first little tab so it'll be easy. And then after that, you hit OK and then it should do like this. So you can transform it using the edit and then free transform. But I won't do that. I'm gonna do I'm gonna hit transform controls and then I'm gonna drag these little corners like so. I'm gonna try to fit it properly. So boom, there we're done. Hit that check, hit a load, and then I'm gonna uncheck the transform controls, then the little box around it is gone. So now it's all selected. I'm gonna go to this little area that says normal. This is the blending mode. I'm gonna hit screen. And it should change in a second. Hopefully. Okay, anyways, it shouldn't, I, I don't know. Oh well. So now all you're gonna do is you're gonna go through every single frame and you're going to change the normal to screen. And that's what it should look like. So I'm going to do that, and yeah, I'm going to pause here. Okay, I'm back, and I've turned everything in every frame into the screen setting, blending mode setting. So after that, I'm going to click on it, make sure it's not pass-through or anything else or normal. It should be screen. You need to make sure it's screen, otherwise it's, otherwise it's not going to work. So after that, you're basically done, you know? Now you're going to export it as a GIF, of course, and it should take a few seconds or so to load if it crashes god you're gonna have to start over again but what do you expect from a free photoshop alternative so here we go here's the ending product so now i've saved that i'm gonna move on to wait i shouldn't have saved it. i already saved it earlier anyway i'm gonna move on to adding my psd coloring so the PSD coloring I use is one of my own, Sad Mocha. Probably won't link it because you guys probably don't like this. I don't care. Anyways, so to download a PSD, went on to DeviantArt, and I looked up PSD colorings in here. 
you can do it on your phone or whatever. And now you're gonna go to you're gonna probably find your PSD download. It needs to be a PSP, otherwise you're screwed. And it's usually on mobile, it should be underneath the image. So yeah, it's already downloaded, so I'm not gonna download it again. And I already opened it. You're gonna go file, open, look in your documents or browse, open that up, find it. Now you're gonna go and repeat the same steps you did to put the GIF onto the edit, duplicate into, duplicate into your initial project, boom, you're done, and that's what it looks like. So you're gonna do file, export as GIF, then that should save it. You should try to make sure that it's full. I mean, you don't have to move these around. I didn't do that because it's, it's weird. So, yeah. Anyways, that's what happens. Boom. With, what's out? With, what's out? With, what's out? PSD coloring is recorded. So, yeah. That's about it. Hope you guys enjoyed this short tutorial. Tell me what other tutorials would you like me to do, and I will probably try to make some. I'm sorry, this wasn't as funny as the last one, but... Oh my god, the original tutorial video I made for this was 45 minutes long, so be thankful. Okay, bye!